truck pulled up round back. Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly-dallying. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. All right, that door's not locked anymore. Shit. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Stay away from the windows. Glad we need your... Hey, Lee. If we don't make it through this, you should know that I think you're a great guy. Shut up, Doug. Doug, <laughs> if we don't make it through this, you should know. That now is not the time to do this. I should know what? Huh? You said I should know. Shit! On it. Are you sure? Oh, shit! What? Oh, shit! Okay, then. Clementine, can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay. Clementine, did you find anything? Nothing! Oh, wait! The window is screwed! Go! Uh, I found something! Still protecting this store, Dad. A choice to make. Yeah, it wasn't even a decision for me. It's the screwdriver zombie. You're not covered with this, you son of a bitch! No! I didn't do anything to you. I got you medicine. Ah, no, Kenny! Oh, okay. I'm not letting somebody else get eaten today. Even if he is an asshole. Hell yeah. Even the dead girl. Duck, stop talking to my kid. friends there and I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city sounds like nobody knows what's happening there when we left a few days ago could have gone either way I got to take my chances oh my god duck is still talking
You gotta do what you gotta do. And I gotta do this. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. Oh my god! This fucking kid! You have said the same thing five times in a row. You- it was boring the first time. Oh my god! Hey kid. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. I Kenny. think you know what you're doing. Shit, man, do any of us? With Clementine, I mean. Earlier, you said you were clueless. I just want you to know that I look at you and I see the type of guy who figures this things out. This is so mind-numbingly awful with him talking Thanks, about man. Derek and Super, yeah. whoever, getting ambushed by Squidius. doing Carly? I'm okay you know considering I do yeah I can't stop thinking about Doug we couldn't have saved him could we I don't think so it happened pretty fast I know it's stupid we just met and he was such a it's just that I think that I liked him I wish you could see my face and how pained I am I'm sorry Carl it's okay thanks though there's been a lot of death in the past few days anyway I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, Lee? What is no, it? No, don't say it. How did you choose? <laughs> we both needed you. You picked me. I thought you needed the help. Ah, that makes sense. But it wasn't a choice like that. It, it was just something I did. I don't know why. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. Yes! Oh my god! <laughs> I've never paid attention to it so much. Get away from my fucking kid, you little fucking creep. Stop saying the same thing. It's all like pow, pow, pow. I thought Super Dinosaur was toast. But you know what? He wasn't. Oh, and then. Hey, Duck, uh, you wanna cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. More like, get the fuck away from her. I'm sorry, there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's... I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense. But it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Aww. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Here, let me go deal with this. Oh man, Clementine, another thing. Oh. What do you want? You like my daughter? Her dad tried to kill me, so... Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Hey, Lee, do you have a second? My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. Oh, thank God it stopped. We're lucky to have you. No, it didn't. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. 
Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. They're worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Okay. At least I don't have to listen to Duck talk about Super Dino and getting ambushed by Squidius or whatever. Next time on The Walking Dead. Oops. I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy! I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's but I coming, didn't. Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. You fuck with us! <laughs> now we're gonna take what we want! You fuck with us, we're gonna you fuck back! Ah! And you all thought Duck was bitten? Well, I'm just doing the same thing. We know this guy's not gonna make it. This isn't happening! No more, please! No more, please! Please, please. Uh, <laughs> Alright, let me see my stats. I can't wait to see my stats. Lie to Herschel, you and 54% were honest. Duck or Sean, you and 30% of players chose to... I didn't, though. I chose nobody. You and 46% of players sided with Larry. You and 52% of the players refused the gun. You and 48% of the players chose... Why is Doug more popular than Carly? Ah, whatever. Alright, well that's the first uh, couple of vids for you there on The Walking Dead. Ah, uh, thank you so much for watching. So, don't hesitate, please hit that like and subscribe button, leave a comment. Tell me you loved it, tell me you hate it, I don't give a flip. But we're all just trying to have some fun here. So thank you so much, peace and love to everybody across the world. Bye-bye.